Ladies and gentlemen, sit down for a minute because you'll fall down in tears of joy if you're standing. If you've been having a bad day, here's some news that'll cheer you up. Shrek is coming back. For many years, there have been rumors of an upcoming Shrek 5 that would continue the ogre's adventures from the previous four movies, although there haven't actually been many details regarding that. Shrek and Puss in Boots are getting rebooted and Chris Meldondry, the man behind Despicable Me, is overseeing the revival. Oh yeah, Puss in Boots is coming back too, but come on guys, you already know Shrek is what people are craving more of. Universal Pictures has tasked Meldondry with finding some fresh storylines to reintroduce the lovable ogre and the sword-wielding feline to new generations of movie Goers. One thing the animation guru doesn't want to mess with is with the vocal performances. Part of the popularity of Shrek is attributable to a voice cast that included Mike Myers, Eddie Murphy, and Antonio Banderas, and in a lengthy profile on Variety, Mel Dondry says he would like to get the band back together. I think the keyword here is reboot, because while it isn't specific in terms of what it means for Shrek and his family, that tends to mean that the story of the universe is altered to make it feel different. Honestly, I hope that doesn't end up happening because we've already established Shrek and Fiona, their kids, the royalty, no, no, let's not mention anything in the third movie because that's trash, but in Shrek Forever After, we learned what life was like without Shrek. All this development over the last four, <clears throat> three movies will hopefully remain for the brand new reboot, though I'm not completely sure what'll actually happen. In the best case scenario, this will indeed be Shrek 5, just maybe with a brief reintroduction of the main star himself since the last movie was 2010, and a new generation of lucky kids get to experience this masterpiece of a franchise for the first time. The worst case scenario is that the series is completely ruined, adding some terrible new element or undoing some of the plot lines that were already accepted in the original few movies. It's also important to mention that Chris Meldondry, the guy in charge of this reboot, is the CEO of Illumination Entertainment, which which created minions. You know, I see a lot of dark paths this new reboot can take simply because of the company behind it. Though in this situation, we should probably all be Makoto Nayagi and keep staying hopeful. I mean, this is Shrek we're talking about. He can't be ruined unless it's the third movie, but there is no third movie, so uh, yeah. Even though he hasn't cracked the code on Shrek, Melodondry sounds confident that it's only a matter of time before moviegoers get to revisit the magical fairy tale setting that made the original movies such a treat. Basically, the brand new and improved Shrek won't be releasing anytime soon. Shrek 5 had been rumored to come out in 2019, but that's extremely unlikely given these new details. Time will tell on what'll actually happen though. I think it'd be amazing if there's a movie where Shrek becomes self-aware of all the memes surrounding him and he goes to conventions and stuff, cause that'd be pretty wacky. But anyway, that's all for this video. Subscribe for more awesome cartoon videos. Give a thumbs up and comment below let me know what you think. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.